to Daria Lashina. She'll take the ball in the uh, line out, but Goss gets uh, uh, leapt up high there. Brazier with the, uh, the attack. Kayla McAllister, and McAllister goes in. And would you believe that this is New Zealand? What a Simpkins leads. Switch play then. Kayla McAllister, she's so strong, her decision making good. And you can see how quick ball that is. What a Simpkins to Woodman on the outside. Portia Woodman, look at the pace here. New Zealand's not offside and really no pressure on that Russian team. What a Simpkins. Alistair, that long pass. There's plenty of space out there. This is a run and try on that far side. And oh, the ball was spilled, was it? By... <laughs> the kickoff then from Daria Lushina is deep into that New Zealand half. Kelly Brazier out through the hands. And well, Rennie Wycliffe, a chance to see her. And then on the outside, here we go again. Just power play every time for New Zealand. And Portia Wunsch, just such a strong runner. Her second try already ending of Sean Horan. Brazier, lovely pass, the wrap around. And look at the space on that far side. Portia Woodman, a hat trick. So the, uh, the kickoff is uh, well taken. Julia Leskosa. And now a good pass here from New Zealand, but New Zealand. Well, wow, lovely little footwork. Rennie Wycliffe, is that right? Stepping and turning. Just showing good hands. New Zealand have got all the space, and the, as you mentioned, Tyranny. Decoy for the left hand side, and then a skip pass out wide. Helena Sudkova making a lot of yards. This is the number 10 for Russia. Good clean out. A bit of confusion there by Lushina, quick to, close to the ruck, but she does well, sets it up nicely. Shift the ball to the right-hand side where there's a bit of space and a tackle broken. I thought she could have gone all the way, Kuro Pachok, but in the end, she gets the pass off, and what a start for Russia. Releasing by the try score at Kuro Pachok, and Jennifer Kish takes it quickly. Strong physical play by both teams at the moment. Breakdown is brutal. Kish Eastmet pass and then nice footwork in the middle of the park by Landry. Rella face it at Scrumman. Well, the pops up beautifully for Charity Williams. It goes on the outside of Fortuitous try, but in. You see there with the feed into the scrum and they get it out to their back line and she. Takes it into the hit up, does Landry. Sets it nicely. That's a nice pass there from Brittany Ben. Unfortunately, doesn't go to hand, but Karen Packwin goes back and cleans it up. Kish on the inside, receives the pass, taken down strongly, but a good clean up. A little bubble, so unless she's going to have to take it in. Very strong on her feet, doesn't she? Just keeps driving. That's good front foot ball, ball there. And it's created the overlap, the dummy and go. So tough to defend from Russ. The half time hooter goes. That's a nice jump and take by the captain in the slum over. Deception on the inside and out. They go on the outside and look at her go. The number 10, she's been brilliant in this game. Elena Zubkova. Long, lanky strides. Nice jump by the Canadians at that line out. Release, no. Pounce on it nicely. Clear the ball along the chain, and now they get some go forward. And here she goes. Charity Williams has got one score in this game, but equally great defense Rock. by Zurukova. Team in there at the breakdown. They win their contact area, all in front. Just wanting someone to come on the short ball, wasn't she? Kelly Russell. Brittany Bean passes it off on the wraparound. Defensive rusher coming up nicely. Should be in their space here. Canada again, taking it into the contact. Charity Williams in the middle of the park. They go to the short side of the field and using the kick. 
Oh, gee. The ball in hand for Russia. As a tip kick. Decoy runner on the inside. A hole opens up for Lashina with a nice off -weight. Unfortunately, he can't go to hand in Canada. Well, they switch straight on to attack after that nice defence. And it's going to be Bianca Perella. Game first start off with Japan, but they're now starting to get into their play. Back. That's a nice take from the restart by Kelly Russell, giving her team back to back possessions. So tough to defend, Be able to receive the kickoffs. Now just starting to, as you say, implement their game plan. Yeah. A nice turnover by yeah, Russia, I think, it was Lashina again doing some good work in this game. Advantage. Oh, and again, I think it's Advantage popped up over. for this Canadian side. Mistake by the Russians under huge amounts of pressure. Play on, play on. See, they're starting to force it now. And... So uh, the kickoff is made by Daria Lushina. Play for Russia to the left of your picture. To the right, the Japanese playing in those distinctive white jerseys, gold numbers on the back. And the possession is key in sevens. As Lushina comes away with the ball, ball in two hands, you'll notice. And Bobkova, Bobkova, spits out the tackle, gets the ball back, and down the blind side. Russia squeezed out there. Good defence from Japan as that Daria Lushina went for the line, but going for the line and getting over the line. There's against six, but there's only one way that Japan want to get so over the line, stay, stay, stay. and that's the straight way. Oh, the ball Advantage. fumbled and coming Advantage. away with the ball. Is Russia. So suddenly the six players are Russia on the uh, counter attack here. The captain, Anna Minilasmova, gets the ball away and then sprinting away down the wing here. It's Korobjuk. And Korobjuk has come away and scored at the other end. And Russia with a play that lead this tie in pool B by 12 points to nil. Overlap is made here for Daria Bobkova. And Daria Bobkova all the way to the line will go in for the third Russian try. And this is her first that she scored. <laughs> Carden in the first half will get rested for the, uh, the rest of this uh, second half. There was a big gap there for uh, the Russian number 11, Korobuchi, to get in. Rock. Down that blind side then goes Guziva. He scored the, uh, the try earlier on. Minislavova. And now it's Russia's turn to get a little bit bunched in their attack. Pukudina. Pukudina, well, she went for a, an offload. And Japan come away with the ball. Now, this is the long striding. Japanese player, Makiko Tomita, with that <laughs> slow ball there, and Russia just guilty of hanging okay, on to the ball. Quick tap and okay. go. Little pop pass here. Tomita, Tomita, two metres short. Tomita, this was Yamaguchi, and on the uh, outside channel, in for the try is it. Well, it's all about whether Russia can hold on to the possession. Rapper an interception, Nakamuru. Can she go towards the try line and get a try? The offload is good. Opportunity here. Oh, the pass is short. It ricochets back. The Japanese captain has to go back and get ball, but it's Yamaguchi. Yamaguchi, Kito goes over. Suzuki with hands on the ball there. And again, it's all got terribly tight. Look at all the Japanese players. Honey potting in the middle. Opportunity though, Kato. Kato gets the offload. Japan, Suzuki. Great hands for Nakamura. Spitely in Dubai when they were beaten in the final. And we all thought that Russia were going to be back on song, but uh, many changes in their squad. So stepping back, Tony Nzoba. Ochieno. Janet Owino took the ball into the contact there. So there's width on the uh, the outside here. Wearing the green bridge, Janet O'Kello. We've seen a lot about her. 
And what about this for pace? Okello, she scored the first one. For Spain. In the outside channels. Wait, wait! Competing for the ball then. As it Korobchuk gets the support. And continuity play. Space out wide. Ball in two hands from Maria Shemshuk. Shemshuk cuts it back in there to Daria Bobkova. And Bobkova backs her pace and goes in under the post. What a great try by Daria Bobkova. So Lushina feeds the uh, scrum. Shemshuk. Guzeva, Guzeva. Strong has to go to deck. But um, the one, Kenyan one, one. player came over the top. Got to make an effort to move out the way. Minis Lasmova, the new captain of this uh, Russian team. Hard yards there for Russia. Now, what can they do to set up this attack? Lovely, lovely little cut and angle from Guzeva. Guzeva stays big. Korobchuk has to go into support. Wrap around play here. Daria Lushina. Lushina. Oh, she's five metres short. We of this first bowl semi final here in Clermont Ferrand. The final stop on the World Rugby HSBC Women's Seven Series. Now, Russia, what can they do to continue their good work in the second half of that first half, which saw them score two tries? Footwork there by Ulia Guzeva. Guzeva backs herself. Wonderful individual skill. Ulya Guzeva striding out to the line will secure the third try. Shina, plenty of height on that ball. Spilt forward by Sheila Chajira. So the advantage being played here. Chajira. Stay, stay. Mini Slavova. This is the Russian captain. Feeds the ball out there to Bobkova. Bokova strong again, and Bokova is away for her second try. When South wait, Africa wait. withdrew, so good experience here. Masinde, Masinde, she's got the pace, but can she get on the outside? Masinde one-handed. Well, this is the electrifying pace. It's actually brilliant. Mila Atenio will let start. There's Masinde. And the thought of these girls going to Rio, it must be an absolute dream. For Russia, they still got to qualify. Remember, the repechage is in Dublin on the 25th of June. So Russia, can they finish strongly? Plenty of space on that wide outside. Gavrilyuk came back, Throdkova. Guzeva had to come back. Lushina. Lushina has an extra player on the outside. Norisina. She just holds on to the ball. And Lushina. Now for Russia. Can they string the passes together? Can they retain the possession? Look at the clock. There's only a few seconds left. And going down that blind side, Guzeva. Oh, lovely try. We've seen some crackers, haven't we? <laughs> Russia, who will go into the final. Look at this. <laughs> Two and a half minutes ago, ball squirts out the back. Flood did well to Mulhall. She's got one outsider. And Doyle just outside that 22. Scored in her last match. Opened the scoring for Ireland against Japan. Megan Williams. Looking for runners outside. Audrey Finn can on to it. Advantage to Russia. Advantage. And they might try and make Ireland pay here. Advantage over. Taken up by Korobchuk. She's got a score. As I mentioned, you know, the Olympic qualifiers coming at the end of June in Dublin. Two of these sides will be competing along with Spain for a place in Rio. Only one place in offer. You have to win that tournament. And this will be a good test or a barometer, at least, for how far Ireland have come. Here is Doyle Scott. Amy Lee Murphy Crow outside who can't hang on to that it's ball. It's another knock on and another advantage to Russia. Advantage Here's the try score for Russia. Kolobchuk with the pass on the outside to Minislamova. Lushina. Direct running from Bobkova. Show and go. Bobkova through the gap inside the 22. Ireland desperate defending at the moment. 
kept alive. Shemchuk, Lushina wants to switch, tackled hard. A little step on the outside from Kutseva. And rush tackle and forces turnover. Lushina, no time to catch her breath. 20 seconds to go. Little dummy in the pass on the out wide. It's one on one here for Russia. And Bobkova, well marshaled by Mulhall. Acting scrum half is Gutseva. Lushina once more. Minislamova. <laughs> Redovskaya hits the deck, and there is the halftime hooter. Next time it goes dead, we'll have the break. Still some rugby to be played, though. Gutseva. Rock! Ireland having to Use defend. It. In this match here, if Lushina can spot it, she steps off her inside and still going Lushina over to 22. It's been all Russia at the moment. Just going to keep the hands on the ball. Yeah, they're going to try and go around the outside. That's exactly what they do. Well, good save is in again. And Russia and Kim Flood to Mulhall. They get on with it quickly. Tyrrell to Miller. Alison Miller trying to go through, Ali Miller, lovely run from Alison Miller, stretches the legs, over the 22, does she need help? Brilliant cover tackle by Minnesota. Nice Captain's that. effort there. Ball at the back, Baxter to Tyrrell, surely Audrey O'Flynn is going to win in the corner. O'Flynn for her. Slap back towards Lushina. Pass from her to Shemshuk, and off goes Good save, huh? Chance to stretch the legs now, Zetrakova. Has to step back inside, good tackle again, sweeping across there. Lucy Mulhall, Lushina. Well, was that crossing or not? Referee says no play on. Irish appeal for the decision, but didn't get it. Russia again, keep it alive. Gavriljuk. Back inside to good save, huh? The Dracova. There's the Hooter. So next time this ball goes dead, that'll be that. Shemshuk. Tackled and tackled well by Hannah Tyrrell. Zodrakova. Lushina. Pass on the outside. Noratsina. Noratsina stretches the legs. And they're going to finish with a bang here, Russia.